Hi guys, I hope you all are doing great. I wanted to share part two of Cottrell's dorm room. And there's also some other things I wanted to share that I forgot to share in the other video. But in this video, I did want to sit down and we do the haul together, but he's at work and I need to go ahead and do this. And then maybe next time I'll try to get him um, to sit down with me and cause we still have a list of some more stuff to get. So I have been shopping. We have been shopping since I last did the other video and I hope it's, um, let's see, looks like it's bright enough. I might have to bring my lights over here, but, um, yeah, I kind of have an idea of how I want to do his room. I'll also take you guys back into the dining room and show you some other things that I picked up the little small thing little small things as well thanks so much guys for the tips i love all the ideas and the tips that you guys are giving me especially when um you know this is my first child going off to school so it's new to me and i don't know exactly what but i want to make sure that he is prepared he has everything he needs because once i leave he's gonna be like an hour almost two hours away from me and I just want to make sure that he has everything he needs. It's not like he's going to, um, originally he was going to go to a school that's actually North Carolina A&T's rival. And he was only going to be like a couple of minutes, maybe 30 minutes from me. So if you're new to my channel, my name is Hope. Um, I don't show my face a lot if I have like some younger kids watching or guys that watch this in the future. Um, my son's he is he just graduated. He's a high school senior. Already had a YouTube channel, so um, he doesn't have a channel, so he won't sit in front of the camera like. Um, but I'll try to get him, like I said, sit in front of the camera with me. So I'm really excited to have him prepared for school because I never got to do this when I thought I was going to be able to do this and go off to school. So my mom really had me excited about, you know, things to look forward to. And I don't have any girls. I have all boys, so I have to make the best. <laughs> <laughs> made the best they don't like a lot of girly decor things so I try to make the best out of what he likes what colors he likes what theme he picked out and everything so speaking of theme I wanted to show you guys this last time I'm trying to keep my other two quiet so if you hear them I apologize and he wants this theme here well not theme he picked out this gray and black bedding set so I did show that in the other haul I'll make sure I will link it below and above in the very first haul and this is by OCM so OCM his school sent me this package and it has like all the different complete packages of everything that you can get in it and a lot of schools I think do this and it's a really convenient way so you don't have to be running over running all over the place to get everything that you need and I think for Cottrell I picked out not that very first package but I, yeah, the varsity collection here and it tells everything that, you know, you get in there and everything. And then I also picked him up the memory foam. So if you've seen that haul, I picked that up. So that was an upgraded price and that varsity collection, sorry guys, was a total of $249. But what I also did was I did an Ebate. I have a widget at the top of my computer to remind me to add Ebates anytime I'm shopping online. And I got percentage back on that. And then I also, they had a 20% off sale that day. OCM did. And I used that on top of that. So I only pay like, um, I think like $211 or something like that. And then I got money back. So that was awesome, guys. Really awesome. What was also awesome is that OCM saw me where I posted on Instagram the trunk and also the pillow so they said thanks for um thanks for speak, uh talking about them in their video and um shouting them out on instagram and everything and i was gonna buy it anyway regardless and they sent control the trunk and the pillow so that was so nice and i'll show that in one second so they have lots of things if you want to make it easier for yourself i didn't see where it was too much um higher in price this is my honest opinion if you've seen that very first video that um ocm didn't even see it um, they sent that out of the kindness of their heart 
and my honest opinion about the quality the value the shipping was really fast and yeah so check them out if you have a senior or in the future have a senior but his school just so happened to send this pack packet and it made it so much easier because you see that i got so much stuff here and more stuff still to pick up okay guys so he has so much dark stuff and my son is going down a little bit i'm going to make sure i'm going to make sure that i say which store i got each item from because it's not in order if i don't please let me know down in the comments and i'll be happy to let you know where i got it from okay so this duffel bag he needed a big duffel bag to if when he comes home or if he goes anywhere and this is a really nice bag it was 14.99 guys at aldi and it's also a rolling bag so um in that aldi grocery haul i just uploaded i didn't have it open but this is a huge um duffel bag and they had it in black and navy and yeah it has pockets and everything so that's a great value i love aldi because they make stuff so much affordable okay moving over here I picked up Cottrell some shower shoes and it was a whole situation at the store because these shower shoes, the slides were actually supposed to be $19.99. You guys clearly see that it says $19, I mean $9.99. Did I say $19 the first time? It's supposed to be $19 and um, they were, this price say $9.99. So they gave it to me for that price. I did have to go back in there and say, Hey, your sign clearly says it's $9.99 because I didn't go in there to spend a certain amount of money that day. And they gave it to me for that price. Also for Bed Bath & Beyond, and that video, they are not sponsored in this video. When Cottrell graduated on awards night, they gave them a envelope and this packet bundle. And it has a checklist in it and also a 20% off coupon. What I thought was great about Bed Bath & Beyond is that even though this coupon is 20% off one single item. What I thought was great with Bad Bath & Beyond is that if you have a college email address that ends in edu, you can get 20% off your entire purchase yeah, transaction up to I think October or November. So I thought that was really great and they talk about that here and I did that for Cottrell so I knew he probably wouldn't shop too much so I told him to forward it to me and i would um use it when i go in there they have a trail well actually i ordered these black pillows they come in two i don't remember how much they were i think they were two for 11.88 or 14.88 on walmart.com so they're like a suede material and i picked up two of those i wanted his bed to be really comfortable and homey feeling so i wanted him to have plenty of pillows not too many but enough i know it's probably you know i didn't want it to be girlish but i wanted him to be comfortable okay so i also picked him up a bissell three in one vac and i was watching some other girls i don't remember their youtube name and they were having a they go to a t and they were saying different things that they needed and i knew that he probably needed this to get up spills and this one was 1988 at walmart so i did show like a shot with me at bed bath and beyond and a little bit at walmart and i showed this vacuum cleaner it was actually cheaper i believe to get it online so i ordered it and it came in the mail also that day with that shot with me i did pick these up these tag alongs the rubbermaid i have another one that's in the dining room that i'll show and these were two dollars so if he goes to the dining hall we did pick the unlimited dining plan for him tim up at target target this week has a sale where it's 10 off of 50 or 25 off of 75 purchase so i actually went twice and took advantage of that and i picked this up the 10 shelf hanging closet organizer i really went back and forth if i wanted to do this because he has a very small closet very small so i might hold on to this and maybe put this in if this doesn't work in Cottrell's dorm room put it in one of my other boys closets um probably jj's he really don't have anywhere for his shoes other than a cube and 
actually for Katrell, we're going to raise his bed a little bit and he will have space to get one of these organizers that you kind of put up under the bed where they has the sections for his shoes so that's what i really want to do but i don't want to get there and be like oh that's not working it's not enough room so we, i may go and purchase both and if not i just give this to jj okay i also picked up these pillows where well, i ordered these pillows from walmart.com and these came in a two pack as well and i don't remember how much exactly they were and then also i picked up from bad bath and beyond that same day when we got the shower shoes the deluxe laundry duffel backpack and you guys suggested this this was $14.99 i think i did use the 20 percent off on something i think it was on this yeah it was on this so it looks like that and he also has like other little um, laundry bags or whatever. And guys, let me know, did your children use their laundry bag as their laundry hamper or did they have like a pop-up hamper? So he doesn't have a lot of space, but I'm going to try to maximize that space as best as possible. And if he needs a laundry pop-up hamper, because I know that can be aggravating to go look for the bag every single time. With that sale, I took advantage of the storage bins, and I hope these fit because I did purchase Cottrell a 8-cube organizer that I'm going to put in front of his bed, and I'm going to move his desk up, and then um, a four cube organizer that we're kind of going to put in front of the window so i hope these work i did order some off of walmart.com but they canceled that part of the order because they didn't have them and i was so bummed so i'm hoping that these fit these were four dollars this week at target and i took advantage of that 10 off of 50 and i picked up one two three four five he may need two more we may not want to put a cube in every one of them so i picked up um five of those and i'm going to put his cube organizer together make sure that it works i save these receipts and um that it fits and if not then i gonna have to go to walmart in the store and look for some black or gray ones okay from dollar tree i picked him up the over the door hook uh two of these these are the only ones that they had the metal ones and then for roses, we have a department store called Roses in our area. And I picked him up two pillow protectors. He said he wants three pillows, but I told him, well, if you want another pillow, because I done got you enough stuff, <laughs> you're going to have to buy it yourself. So he's going to have to go pick up some stuff himself and um, like his toiletries and so forth because he's been working. And um, yeah. Also, I picked this up from Aldi. If you've seen the Aldi grocery haul, it's a bed rest, and it was $9.99. And uh, Josiah actually likes this. So, um, I thought, I asked Cottrell, would he use it? Do he want a bed rest? I know he does like to lay on the bed. So, I picked him up one. I probably, I hope it's sturdy enough for him, and it doesn't, um, you know how sometimes you lay on pillows, and they just instantly are flat. And some of these Walmart pillows feel like they're like that, but I'm going to have to tell him to make sure he fluffs them. So, yeah. Then, guys, as well, I picked up this pillow. And um, this is probably the second one or third one. Yeah, third one he has that has some pizzazz. If you've seen that dollar sign one that I picked, that I got from OCM. So, this one was, I think, 11 or 12 by itself. And I thought it was different and unique. And it was more boyish. So, I got that one, too. And then I also ordered him a saucer chair. Now this one folds completely flat. Josiah likes this chair too. And I actually probably should have waited till Aldi has one this week. But this one was um, $30, which I thought was a good price. And I think Aldi's is the same. It might be a little bit bigger. It's shaped a little bit different. And I ordered this one off of Lime. And he can just fold it. And I thought that sometimes you get tired of sitting in your desk chair or you get tired of sitting on your bed so maybe he wants to sit in another chair that's why i got this uh, also another trip at target i picked these up a couple of weeks ago and these were these tumblers 
and they were 70 they've been advertising these these are microwavable and dishwasher i think yes yeah, safe and bpa uh oh bpa safe so these were 79 dollars. they come in black they took all the ones in black but i think the gray is pretty and then they have them in navy blue which i thought was pretty um i can't remember if it's any other color i want to say a green but i don't remember and i got them three of the tumblers two of the bowls and then i went to i'll show that one second walmart got that and then i got him two of the plates so that he probably could get paper products and be fine i may still get him some paper products but i got him some dish detergent i believe so he can um i do have to get him a rag but every time i go on dollar tree they don't have any rags so i do have to get him um a dish rag so I thought that was a great price for 79 cents each. And then I went to Walmart and picked him up some silverware. And I believe this was a dollar or maybe a little more than a dollar. I think they were a dollar. So yeah. I also picked him up a curtain rod. This one is from Roses. So it's a lightweight curtain rod. And I think it's long enough for his window. I probably need to open it to make sure because I was looking at the picture and I was like, oh, that window's longer than I thought. And I think what I'm going to do is just get him some shears, probably some gray ones from Walmart. Um, not the long ones, but the short ones to put on his window because I want all the sunlight to be able to come in. And then what OCM sent me, guys, was this trunk, which I am really grateful and so thankful for them doing that because that saved me some money uh i know walmart some of these are a hundred and some dollars i know walmart they have one that's all black that's like 55 57 right now and this is a really nice trunk uh oh sorry so he can put a lock here and lock his stuff in it and then it has a magnetic lock there of course it has the buckles here and then i believe yeah this one has where you can put wheels on it too you can buy the wheels online and then this is what the inside looks like so a really really nice trunk really nice and then they also sent him the slice slice baby pillow um pillow which i thought was really cute so that will tie in with the gold, the black, and the cream that he has going on. And then also I showed in an Aldi haul that I picked him up a 8 inch air circulator fan. This was only $9.99. So I heard one of the students when they did a tour was saying that NCAT A&T did not turn on the air conditioning yet. So I know that Cottrell is hot natured, so I wanted to make sure that he had a large enough fan in his room. But when he went for orientation, the air was on. I knew it was because it was in the middle of the summer then. But um, it probably was springtime then or something when he said that. Or it might have just been a warm, mild winter day. So I just wanted him to have a big enough fan. But he said at orientation that he was really comfortable and it was cold in the room. Also, I picked this up. I've been eyeing this in the store. I actually, yeah, I ordered it. I don't think I bought it. I ordered it. But I've been eyeing it in the store. It was $9.88, a little world globe. And I thought that would be nice, a little black globe. So I think globes are nice in rooms. And I want to get one for JJ's room too. Also, this little black pub. He is so cute. And I was going to pick him up in our local store. But he was $9.88. But um, his little face was messed up. And if you look on here, he has a couple of flaws. But it's not as bad as they were in the store. So he is so cute. Especially when um, their mascot is, I think, a bulldog or Aggie. So, yeah. I'll put that up there and make sure it don't fall. Then I also got him an iron from Walmart. Oh, these came from Walmart, guys. Walmart, Walmart, Aldi. And um, the iron came from Walmart. It's just a basic iron because he doesn't iron a whole lot. But I want him to have something if he needs to iron some dress pants or whatever. And I think it was like seven, eight dollars for the iron. I also picked him up, which I looked high and low. I looked on 
Bed Bath & Beyond they had one and I also looked on Amazon and I went with this one the picture on Amazon this is a shower caddy and I was wanting to get him something that was masculine it wasn't um, too girl feminine and I did pick up these shower caddies I know probably the other guys trail said he didn't mind carrying it or gonna carry these as well so I'm gonna let him I open this so you can see what it looks like it doesn't look as big as it looks on the picture but I'm gonna let him pick because this is flat and collapsible he can still have it stored somewhere because he might get there and realize that this is not going to work for him but I don't think he takes a whole lot of stuff in the bathroom but this came off of Amazon I think it was like twelve dollars it also has like a hook up here so he can hook it on I just got a, a kick out of listening to the girls in the video talking about how don't let nothing touch nothing because you don't want to get anything and um, how they hang their stuff up with a hanger and don't lay anything down so uh, I just thought that was interesting I told Trail to watch some of those videos so I don't know if he did or not because I was like I'm gonna know more about the school than him so I really like this it also has I'll make sure I put the link down below it also has like little straps in here so he can put like his razors or something like that in here so this is what the one from Aldi looks like and I didn't know if like he just wanted to throw his stuff in there and then take the straps and go or he you know I just let him pick especially after I saw that this one wasn't that big it's big but it's not it's not um, huge so and then um, if it just doesn't work he can bring it back home and you can take this little insert out he can make it flat and throw it in a cube organizer in a drawer somewhere in his closet what trail also did I told him I was like you know mom and daddy is you know kicking out money so you gonna have to buy some of your stuff yourself also teaching him some responsibility so he has been working this summer and he bought the other day a Vizio 32 inch TV he didn't have one in his room well he had one but it was like an old TV um, those first flat screens that came out and they um i wanted him to get a smart tv but you know kids you know they do stuff too fast they order stuff too fast and i told him to wait amazon prime day but they really i didn't come across any special really good deals with tv so he ended up ordering it the next day but he should have just waited so i think he paid one no right at a hundred dollars for this but I really wish he got the smart TV and paid a little bit more and then this is what I had in my room it was holding my makeup and a lot of other stuff I'll show in a video in the future and right now I'm organizing my makeup and I knew I was going to give this to him um, it's a utility card and I think Walmart still has this card it is a little uh, wobbly but it's it'll do the job and lastly guys I'm going to do everything else in a separate video because it's gonna be too long I picked up this foldable ottoman that I showed in that Aldi grocery haul and it is really nice they also had some for girls if your Aldi still may have it they had fur ones and they had like a teal green one with like gold polka dots and I thought it was so cute. And if they still have it, you know, um, I am looking for something else at Aldi, then I may go and get it. I don't know for myself, but I don't need it. So they have pockets here. And then it opens like this. It's easy to put together. And I'm going to collapse this so it would be easier to take to his dorm room. And it sway just like the pillows and everything. So I just wanted to give him some added comfort if he wanted to put his feet up or whatever and if he was playing his video game sitting in this chair or whatever studying which he should be studying so guys that is it for this haul i will make another haul of the other stuff that's still on the table and then we have another list of like it's just like small things that he would need and um that i didn't get yet so thanks so much for watching as always don't forget to like comment and subscribe and y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.